Are you overcomplicating your online form purchasing? When it comes to converting your online site visitors into buyers, don't overcomplicate things. The process is actually easier than you think. I'm Alex with JotForm, and in today's video, we'll share with you seven tips to help you get more purchases from your online forms. Let's get into it. One of the easiest steps you can take in increasing your purchase conversions is to optimize and test your form for desktop, tablet, and mobile browsers. Perusing a site on a desktop is only one way for users to access your site. Make sure their experience on all mobile devices is seamless. Perhaps a user tries to access your site on their cell phone, but your form doesn't work properly or look professional. They're likely going to abandon filling it out. If anything, make sure your form is responsive, that all images, GIFs, and videos are the right size and load quickly, and that all of the form fields display correctly. Make your user experience even better by disabling pop-ups. Pop-ups are distracting and take visitors away from the most important task on the page, making a purchase. Disable pop-ups where your form lives as well as on mobile devices, generally speaking. They tend to not work well on mobile devices and negatively affect usability. Another way to increase payment form conversions is to have a secure and trustworthy website. Our digital safety is important and even more so when it comes to entering sensitive payment information. Look over this checklist to ensure that your site is secure. Make sure your website and form are both encrypted using HTTPS, add a privacy policy, include trust seals on the payment form, include a link to your privacy policy, add social proof elements such as testimonials or case studies, and consider including a money back guarantee. Nothing stops a payment form from completion like a slow website. In fact, 40% of site visitors will abandon a site that takes longer than three seconds to load. To ensure a quick loading website, make sure all images are compressed. If you're unsure of your website's load speeds, test it out using Google's PageSeed Insight tool. Options are usually welcomed, but when it comes to website purchases, less is more. The more time and effort it takes a potential customer to complete the payment action, the less likely they're going to do it. Take your checkout fields into consideration. How many of those do you actually need? Stick with the basics like full name, email address, credit card number, expiration date, and security code. Another hot tip is to focus on form content, not your website's aesthetics. It can be tempting to spend time and energy on testing minor design and color changes such as a button or headline colors. Push the temptation aside and focus on your content. Think through your website's flow. Try putting yourself in your visitor's shoes and see if the logic of your site works or needs a few tweaks. If you're still struggling with purchase conversion, it may be a good idea to provide contextual support on your forms. Providing helpful text each step of the way will help make it easier for visitors to complete your form. Also, providing customer support team access via live chat or easy to find email and phone numbers is extremely helpful. You could also implement a chat bot that walks visitors through your payment form step by step. The best way to increase your payment form conversions is to focus on the fundamentals. Whether you try one or all seven of these tips, your conversion rate will surely skyrocket in no time. Let's do a quick review. To increase your payment form conversion, just try these seven tactics. Optimize your form for mobile visitors, disable your pop-ups, implement security best practices, improve your site speed, only request essential information, focus on your site content and provide support. Thanks for watching JotForm. I'm Alex. See you next time.